As the healthcare industry faces a critical shortage of workers, a situation that was heightened by the COVID-19 pandemic, Holyoke Medical Center and Valley Health Systems are hoping to make some recruitments. 22 News reporter Kaylee Thomas is live in studio to explain why there's been a growing demand for healthcare workers locally. Ciara, the demand for health care continues to outpace the amount of health care workers across the state. This is due to factors like population growth, advancements in technology and growing emphasis on preventive care. Very rewarding career uh, to have. There is a growing need for jobs in health care, which are growing faster than most other industries. The Holyoke Medical Center and Valley Health Systems is one of many looking to fill vacancies. Everything from behavioral health to critical care are in short supply. I think after COVID, there really was a shift in how people work and where people work. And other, um, you know, students are not going into health care. You know, again, they're exploring different, you know, different careers. So we're trying to bring them back, bring the interest back. The Bureau of Labor Statistics reports education and health services gained 1,400 jobs last month here in the state. Over the last year, 21,000 jobs were added. Some of the available positions at the center are medical assistants, patient safety associates, and CNAs. Their emergency department especially needs nurses. Emergency department is the safety net in the hospital or in the community, so we're just trying to be there and you know make sure we have resources for everybody who needs our services. But measures are being taken to mitigate this issue temporarily until positions are filled. Utilizing our staff, core staff's picking up additional shifts. Our per diems are helping us out, and we do have a couple travelers in the department to bridge that. If you're interested in working for Holyoke Medical Center and Valley Health Systems, visit WWLP.com to learn how you can apply. Working for you tonight, Kaylee Thomas, 22 News.